Hello everyone, I'm Tamara from Georgia and currently in Delhi promoting medical education abroad for Indian students who want to study MBBS abroad. So in today's video, we will be speaking about one of the largest and most famous medical universities in Georgia, SEU University, which is also known as Georgian National University. The university is located in Tbilisi, the capital of Georgia, and it was established in 2001 under the name of Ilya Javjavadze, who was a very famous Georgian public figure, journalist, politician, and a very successful writer. SEU is committed to providing a high-quality education that prepares students for successful careers in their chosen fields. The university's faculty includes for both Georgian and international professors who bring a wealth of knowledge and experience to the classroom. The SEU University has partnerships with the universities around the world providing students with different opportunities to study abroad and gain valuable international experience. You can find um, of the most advanced medical school facilities at Georgian National University. For example, students get robotic surgical training medical equipment and stimulated mannequin stations. It offers students modern classrooms, a library, computer labs, cafeterias, and even a sports center, including a gym and swimming pool. <clears throat> if we talk about tuition fees at this university, SU University, for MD course, MBBS is around 5,500 USD per year, which is around 4 lakhs. The admission process at this university for international students is a straightforward and a quick process. Candidates must have passed uh, like physics, chemistry and biology and as these are compulsory subjects to study MBBS. The student's age should be at least 17 years old. There is no English language test required, but you may have an online interview with the university just as an introduction to make sure the candidate is capable of communicating in English. Now, is NEET required to study MBBS in Georgia? This is a frequently asked question, so the answer is yes, it is. The Medical Council of India has made the NEET exam mandatory for all MBBS admissions for Indian students within and outside of India. However, the candidates must score a minimum qualified mark in NEET to apply and to be able to apply for MBBS admission in Georgia and other countries. Please keep in mind that universities in Georgia are fully recognized by MCI and WHO. And yes, your degree is valid in India and worldwide. I often get asked if students have to learn Georgian language for MBBS course in Georgia. So let me tell you and clear this now that the medium of teaching is English language and Georgian as well. So, and Georgian language for international students is not mandatory to learn, but they get English, Georgian classes. University offers students Georgian classes for essential communication. So it's up to you if you want to learn something new and gain an incredible experience or not. SU University is just a walking distance away from a nearby metro station and it's a plus point as it's a very comfortable way for students because most of international students in Georgia uh, use public transport for which they get a student card that is like having an extra benefit so yes it's a point to remember. One more good point is that there are hospitals nearby the university, again within walking distance, so for students during internship it's easier to relocate and manage their time. 
Now, let me tell you shortly about Georgia. It is one of the safest countries. Actually, it is in the list of top 10 safest countries in the world. Students here experience high quality European lifestyle at a very affordable cost. We have it all. Everything is available, fully furnished flats, hostels, Indian food. So yes, it's a beautiful small country with values and traditions. I'm sure you will love it here. So that's it for today. I'll be back with more informative videos about medical universities in Georgia very soon. Till now, still then, you stay tuned. If you have any queries or doubts about the admission process, please feel free to contact me. Good luck and thank you so much for watching.